Good evening and welcome to our New Year's Eve service of 2020. What an exciting year this has been. A very different type of year too. In six days, the wise men will come to acknowledge the birth of the Christ child. And today is the sixth day of Kwanzaa. But it's also a time in which we end the year 2020. And though the Christ child was born five days ago, or almost six, we acknowledge that his light shines throughout the world. Yes, this has been a challenging year. We all know that. And a number of people have lost loved ones this year, in addition to losing their jobs and having their homes and family and friends separated. Yes, we await for the, the vaccine and for folks to get vaccinated. But it's a time in which we say thank you also. Thank you for our lives. Thank you for those who have shown care. And may those persons be we, we, who express love from Christ Jesus. We are cups, cups that are constantly being filled. The question is, how do we tip ourselves over to let the good stuff out? From Ray Bradbury, to you, for us. We have a bell that rings, and it will ring 12 times, acknowledging the end of 2020 and the beginning of 2021. We're doing it Pacific time at 8 p.m. 
but in Atlantic time, it will be midnight. And that's the way the world is. It's not all the same. There is an evolution that happens as we live our lives. There's an evolution that happens in different parts of the world as well. So let's give thanks tonight for surviving 2020. And may we be inspired to live a blessed 2021. Amen.